times with the goodies where every single day is a good day and today is a great day to be alive oh bump here oh multitasking it is cold here in the morning it's 48 degrees and I did not take into account that my hands would be freezing got my coffee it's about 7 in the morning going for a little cruise figured I would uh, start the vlog this way just this past week we kind of hit a milestone. And when I say we, I mean Lindsay and I and the family. Jackson started kindergarten. Now I know I said in the last vlog that I'm gonna be doing a lot more fitness, but I think it's really important to document these moments when there's a lot of life change. And even though kindergarten is such a low level or a low, low grade, but it's a big change for, for Jackson. And if you've been a consistent viewer of the vlog, you know how important fatherhood, whoa, how important fatherhood is to me. Yana, they haven't seen you in a really long time. Yeah. And finally, they get to see you. Because really, they just want to see you. They don't want to see me. Yeah. Today, Jackson is going to kindergarten for the first time. Yeah. How excited are you for, for kindergarten? Are you excited? How do you feel? How do you feel? Uh, uh, I don't know. You don't know? Um, are you excited? No. Happy? He, he no? Nervous. Nervous? Nervous. Why? What, what are you nervous for? Uh, my teacher uh, with this would be new. Uh, yeah. Yeah, about learning new things. Yeah. 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 The box heavy. Uh oh. It is so heavy. It's hard to lift it up. Show the show the people oh, no. your backpack. Ooh. Oh, nice. Who is that? Sonic. Sonic. And then show them your shoes. Flex. Let's see those shoes. Ooh. Welcome. Let me see those shoes. Ooh. Nice. All right, guys. I'm gonna. I'm going to time you guys, and you gotta run down to the end of the block, but don't go past the alleyway, okay? Don't go past the alleyway. But Malcolm is cheating. Yeah, he's cheating. He's way ahead. He's Malcolm, come back here. Anything for an advantage, okay? So you're gonna run all the way down to the back, and then you're gonna come down, and then I'm gonna time you. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Look at that. He's off to the races. Off to the races. Look at Malcolm. Woo! Look at those feet. Yeah. Come on, Jackson. Bring it home. Bring it home. Come on. Bring it home. Bring it home. Bring it home. Bring it home. Yeah. It must, it must be the shoes. Huh? What do you guys think? Is it the shoes or is it you? Um, Malcolm is actually cheap. Why is he cheating? Because he went way ahead of me. He went ahead of you? Did you cheat? What? Yeah, you did. Okay. Well, hey. I stopped going way ahead of Hey, you guys, we got to get ready for school. Yeah. You ready? Let's go. It's crazy how fast time goes. Uh, it feels like yesterday Jackson was was born. We were taking him home from the hospital, and we were kind of getting used to this new norm of life uh, with having a, a brand new child in, in our household. And there's something special about having your firstborn and watching them kind of go through the paces of life. They are uh, the leaders. They're leading the pack. Our pack of three three kids and. You know, you're always experiencing your first with them. This this past week has been uh, a lot of mix of emotions for everyone. Uh, Jackson uh, consistently would say that he was nervous on the way to school, uh, that he was scared on the way to school, 
And even though we uh, prepared him for this time, you know, we were feeling the same emotions too for him. But it's always cool to see your your oldest go through the paces of life first. So we are just about to get to uh, Jackson School and it's becoming real now. All the years that we've been prepping him. Okay, Gianna. All the years that we've been prepping uh, Jackson for this day, pre-kindergarten, pre all those uh, developmental classes that we've taken. This is the day. This is the moment, Jackson. I know. How are you feeling? Nervous? You excited? No, I'm only nervous. You're only, You're only nervous. nervous? Well, I want you to know that mom, dad, Malcolm, Gianna, grandma, grandpas on both sides, they, we are all super proud of you and we're so excited for you to start this new journey. Yeah? You ready to rock and roll? We're not going past your school. We are going to your school. Not my school. Up here. Remember? Up here. That's back to Yeah. That's do you have do you have like bubbles in your stomach? Why do you have tears? Oh, mommy's crying. You okay, mommy? Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Why did you have tears? I'm so excited for you. I don't see us coming from the high. We're so excited for you, Jackson. Mom, is there a bus? Ah, oh, there's two buses up there. Oh, gosh. All right, we are here. Why are there two buses? No, we go around. I am very passionate about fatherhood. Very passionate about fatherhood and how important it is to, to me. And I love being a father. I believe that the foundation of fatherhood for me is obviously my faith. And there is a legacy that I want to make sure that I uphold for my family. And for me, I don't necessarily know my biological father or seed donor. Some of you guys have heard that story already. And it's so important for me to change that. Now, I did have my dad, my father. He wasn't the seed donor. I'll, I'll link a video that I made a long time ago kind of explaining the story uh, in my life. So I had a male, male role model in my life, but it wasn't the seed donor. And a part of me, it kind of has, has bothered me a little bit, just the fact that fatherhood is so important and so special to me that why would someone want to not be a part of their own child's life? It, it doesn't make sense to me. Now, if that's you, I'm sorry. Don't be a bum. <laughs> make sure that you are a part of your child's life. But my goal is to continually, to consistently be involved and to show love and to show that uh, fatherhood to our to my kids is, is important and they will never know what not having a father is like unless you know something happens to me just watching Jackson go through the paces like why would you want to miss that that's so special watching your child go through kindergarten uh, or start kindergarten I should say it's a special moment these are special moments, and even though parenting is hard, and you know, being a father is hard, it's worth it. It is so worth it. And I know that this isn't necessarily uh, a fun, hot topic that we can talk about, but I don't know. I'm too passionate not to share, share it. And in order for me to be the best father that I can be, I may, need to make sure that I am taking that time for for self-love every single day. Hence, why I'm riding my one wheel.
Just like that, Jackson is off to kindergarten. <laughs> in a in a blink of an eye, Are you still he's there. Malcolm? How do you feel, Malcolm? Yeah, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Are you excited to have like your brother gone, or do you miss him already? What do you feel? How you feeling, Malcolm? Do you miss him? Whoa! Why can the window? He does not miss him at all. It's just the first day, yes. It's still brand new. But yes. No Jackson. Yeah. All by myself. But I was telling Lindsay how important it is from birth to five years old on how important it is from birth to five years old to prepare your child for kindergarten. And we have done just that. It is emotional, but at the same time, as parents, we got to make sure that we do the best that we can to make sure that they soar. Um, Buckle's trying to play. He's not listening. Make sure that they do the best, that we do the best that we can, put them in the right programs, get them socialized, get them learning. Um, and there's a lot of people that contributed to that um, as well. So I'm excited for Jackson and I'm curious to see how his day goes. Jackson, how was, how was school? Good? Yeah? What was your favorite thing about school today? Uh, you guy. Us? Staying out a little bit, and there's a man guy. Oh, that was your favorite part? Yeah. Oh my gosh, my heart. You like that we stayed with you mm. for a little bit? Mm. Oh, yeah. What was different about school? You don't know? Was it shorter or longer? Younger. Were there new people in your class? Were there new people in your class? Yeah. Yeah. But there wasn't all of them. There wasn't all of them. No, just a little bit. Yeah, there was only two at my table. Yeah. And then no more. Yeah. Well, I'm glad that you had a good first day. We missed you so much. What did you, what did you guys say? We said that we really missed you and that we uh, are very proud of you. Why? Because you're leading the way, my friend. You're leading the way. <laughs>